Hey there, art lovers. Welcome back to this art, the channel where we dive deep into the world of artists and their incredible creations. Today, we're going to explore the works of the talented Frederick Child Hassam, an American Impressionist painter. Hassam was known for his stunning urban and coastal scenes, capturing the beauty of everyday life in a unique and vibrant way. He played a crucial role in bringing Impressionism to American collectors, dealers, and museums, alongside artists like Mary Cassatt and John Henry Twachtman. With over 3,000 paintings, oils, watercolors, etchings, and lithographs, Hassam was truly an influential artist of the early 20th century. Let's start our journey through Hassam's art with Isle of Shoals. This painting transports us to a serene coastal landscape, where the play of light and shadow on the water creates a mesmerizing effect. Next up, we have Seascape. In this piece, Hassam captures the raw power and beauty of the sea, with crashing waves and a dramatic sky that evokes a sense of awe and wonder. Moving on to Spring Landscape with a Farmer and White Horse. Here, Hassam brings the countryside to life, showcasing the vibrant colors of spring and the peacefulness of rural life. Now, let's take a look at Mill Site and Old Total Dam, Cos Cobb. This painting transports us to an industrial scene, where the old mill and dam stand as a testament to the history and progress of the area. Traveling to the west coast, we have On the Snake River, Oregon. Hassam captures the rugged beauty of the river, with its winding path and majestic mountains in the background. Heading south to Havana, we come across Place Central and Fort Cabanas, Havana. This painting immerses us in the vibrant streets of Havana, with its colorful buildings and bustling atmosphere. In Mrs. Hassam at Villiers Lobel, we see a more personal side of the artist. Hassam portrays his wife in a peaceful garden, capturing her beauty and grace with delicate brush strokes. Now, let's explore Northeast Gorge at Appledore. This piece takes us to a rocky coastline, where the crashing waves and rugged cliffs create a sense of drama and power. Moving on to Nudes at the Cove. Here, Hassam explores the human form in a natural setting, celebrating the beauty and vulnerability of the human body. Continuing our journey, we come across Road to the Sea. This painting invites us to follow a winding road that leads us to the vastness of the sea, symbolizing the journey of life and the unknown that lies ahead. Next, we have The Fisherman, Kos Ka. Hassam captures a quiet moment of fishermen at work, showcasing their skill and dedication in a peaceful coastal setting. Traveling to the west coast again, we find ourselves at Telegraph Hill, San Francisco. This painting offers a panoramic view of the city, with its iconic hill and bustling streets, capturing the energy and vibrancy of urban life. Now, let's take a stroll through Boston Common at twilight. Hassam paints a serene scene of the park at dusk, with the soft glow of streetlights and the tranquility of nature. Moving on to Jonquils. This painting brings the beauty of spring flowers to life, with vibrant yellow jonquils blooming against a lush green background. Finally, we have Church at East Gloucester. Hassam captures the charm of a small coastal town, with a quaint church nestled among the trees, inviting us to explore its peaceful surroundings. And there you have it, a glimpse into the incredible world of Frederick Child Hassam. We hope you enjoyed this journey through his art. Stay tuned for more fascinating artists and their masterpieces on this art. Thanks for watching. Thank you.